All right, we're here with Cameron Hughes, and you're kind of a big deal in the wine industry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, go, we'll go with bit. that, yeah. Sure, yeah. we're getting there, we're getting there, we're working towards it. Now, how did you get into this industry? Uh, you know, my father, I grew up actually with the Gallo kids. My dad's been in the wine business 40 years now, and uh, when I got out of college, didn't know what to do. Um, I uh, started as a cellar rat at Corbett Canyon Winery, and eventually ended up slinging Franzia box wines, Corbett Canyon, and that's how I cut my teeth on sales and distribution. But it wasn't until after I worked at an import company, I learned about the negotiant business and uh, these guys would put a blend together uh, out of a winery in Europe, bottle it up, import it and sell it. In our case, not sell it. Company cratered, they fired me. Um, I bought 500 cases of Napa Cabernet, put my own label on it, sold it out of the back of my car and the rest is history. That's wow. how we got started. Well done. Well, and things are going well, clearly. <laughs> yeah, no, we're having a great time with this. And so now, where did this idea come from, like the premium you know, wines at a decent price right. as well? Right, so, well, we've always been about value, low overhead and great value. But it wasn't, when I was selling the wine out of the back of my car, I could never get momentum. So um, I actually found a big retailer down in California, I put wines together for them, and we built the lot program. And it was built to interface with the bulk wine market, take advantage of all these high-end opportunities. Because wine itself doesn't cost a lot to make. It costs a lot, the overhead costs a lot, the marketing costs a lot. So by um, having tremendous momentum behind each wine and offering fantastic value, we pull a ton of wine through the marketplace and we excite our customers because we're all about value. Now these are your babies in front of us. You were all telling me before. All yes, my children, right. yes. So, so what don't do ask me which one's my favorite. <laughs> okay, fine. Well, what do you have then here? Yeah, so today we've got um, Lot 300, this is out of a basically $125 a bottle program in the state. So you can imagine it'd be probably 200 up here. Wow. And uh, really, really high-end Napa Cabernet. This is something you need to leave in the bottle for probably another couple of months before it even begins to flesh out. Okay. And then we have some spot market buys. This is one that I just bought from a high-end winery. And then this is wine that we make with a grower and winery partner. We also have a San Inez Syrah made for us by a famous winemaker on the Central Coast. Zinfandel, again a spot market buy, uh, and then this is wine that was made for us in a partnership. So we do all sorts, of, whatever it takes to get great wine in a bottle at a great price, that's what we do. I like your style. Thank you so much, and I should probably try all of them in a bit. Yeah, you should. Come yeah. on by. Yeah, we'll I will. Do it. I will. Okay, thanks so much. My pleasure. There you go. Thanks for having me.